Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I hope all of you are doing well, staying at home and staying safe. So today we are going to be comparing the performance difference between DirectX 11 and DirectX 12 in 6 modern games. If you are not aware of what DirectX is, just know that they are low-level graphics APIs for Windows-based operating systems that are responsible for running the games on your PC. Most modern games support both DirectX 11 and DirectX 12. At this point of time, DirectX 11 is quite old and we are seeing a major shift in the usage to DirectX 12 and Vulkan, which is another graphics API. So in this video, you will be able to see a complete performance analysis in 6 different AAA games between these two graphics APIs. I have included the real-time frames per second as well as the minimum and 0.1% and 1% low frames as well because changing APIs affects the minimum frame rates more than the average. I hope after this video, you'll always have a clearer idea of which settings to use in these games for a better performance. The system specs for this comparison includes the Ryzen 5 2600X and Nvidia GTX 1660Ti coupled with 16GB of DDR4 3000MHz RAM. All the games that you are seeing are running at 1080p resolution and at ultra settings. I hope you guys find this video useful and if you do so, please leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel. So without further ado, let's move on to the benchmarks. Captain, this fine young lady could use our help. Carlos, you didn't even think to ask fine young lady her name? She is an elite operative of RPD Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Valentine. It's Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS platoon leader Mikhail Viktor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Right. How's that going for you? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the 100,000 civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving, we can evacuate some survivors. But we need help. My men cannot do this alone. I'm in. But I am on their side, not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Jill. All right, super cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. Okay, first things first. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. More survivors. We've got to get that train moving.
while I'm away. Sir, yes, sir. Great. Let's go. feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Anyone here? Federal Bureau of Control. All these years I've been looking for them and they were hiding in plain sight. Hello? Hey. Excuse me. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm Ahti. The janitor, by the way. You'll work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, they, they, you are no hell of it. There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you are out. A moment. You know what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. Seventeen years since the men of this building took him.
Shit. Shit, shit, shit. You want me to pick it up? The murder weapon? Really? It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me and it was just noise and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? I'm happy. Happy to be here. Thank you. 